Hello, welcome to Lighthouse Tarot, where we embrace the light within ourselves and within others. I'm your host, of course, Will O'Reilly, coming back at you with a new video. Today, we're gonna to be talking about everything Scorpio rising, specifically transformation in your life. So if you're in this video and you're going through something kind of tough right now, there is hope. That's what I wanna tell you. If you don't know any, if you don't take anything from this video, do know that there is hope. And I'm gonna be talking about my personal experience because I'm a Scorpio rising with Pluto in the first house so just for an example you know because I'm a visual person this is your card from the tarot card that represents Scorpio it is the tower this is um, everything falling apart in your life but these are bad things happening so good things can come into fruition so your life can transform into something totally different and benefit you in the best way possible so speaking from personal experience as a Scorpio rising, I have been homeless before, I have been without a car before, I have been struggling for food, um, uh, I didn't have custody of my daughter for a little bit, things, things were rough, you know, I lived in different states, uh, I struggled with my mental health, a lot of like had to go to little hospitals and all that until I got everything sorted out. But that last year was a really tough year for me. And I'm thinking last year was my tower moment. And you're gonna have a lot of tower moments as Scorpio rising. Why? Because Scorpio is ruled by Mars and Pluto. Pluto wants to change the whole world as a collective. It also represents everything taboo, everything secretive, and the dark coming out into the light. And uh, when people see you as a Scorpio rising, sometimes it has Pluto, such as because it's such an intense planet, it um, people have a love or hate reaction with us Scorpio risings, dude. They either love us or they hate us, and they don't even have to have a reason for that. It could be just meeting you, and they're like, "Wow, I really like your vibe. Like, I feel really drawn to you." Because Scorpio, being a water sign, being feminine, it brings people in, but it can also repel people. And so with that, just take that with a grain of salt. Some people are gonna love you, some people are gonna hate you and just don't even wanna hang out with you. And that's fine. Go to the people that are your tribe, people that really care about you, love you, people that are on the same spiritual transformation that you're going through and that will really help. But yeah, I have been homeless, I've been without a car. Uh, things, were, things were rough, right? I was struggling, man, I was struggling last year. 2023 was probably the worst and most traumatic part of my life but this year has changed tremendously I just uh, I well it started off kind of bad I had a job at Waffle House and it was really really stressful I did the training and then I just told them hey you know this isn't for me it was too stressful it's not it's not good on my mental health so I went ahead and I just had a feeling that I needed to well I had seen Colton's steakhouse um, online and they were hiring I put an application and I called them and they said hey can you come in for an interview today now normally without having my car right now I was thinking like oh, maybe I should wait next week but uh, my intuition with Scorpio rising you have good intuition told me go in for that interview and I went into that interview the manager absolutely loved me. She was like, I can tell you have a really good personality and that you're gonna be really good in front and you're gonna be a host. I do wanna cross train you as a server for a little bit. And I was like, I can do serving for two days, but for the most part, I wanna be a host. That's my dream job. I love hosting. I love dressing nice. I love being very polite to people, telling them about a reward. And I'm very good at rotating because I used to be a server for 10 years and I, I know how it works like I know if a server needs a break not to seat them I know if a server wants to have more tables to seat them and I know also to make it fair around everyone so I'm not going to give you five tables when someone else only has one right so I got hired for the job so one I have a job now two I'm getting my car fixed this week so I'll have reliable transportation. And in about six months, I'm getting my own place, which means I can have my daughter. So I'm really freaking excited. And that's that's what you gotta think about when things fall apart, when you have a really shitty year, when everything goes to the gutter, whenever you're homeless, you don't have a car, you don't have a job, things are looking bad. And with Scorpio Risings, you guys, because of um, the Pluto placement, you're gonna attract people around you that are going through dark moments too. And it's your job, if you're an evolved Scorpio Rising, to heal others. You're just supposed to lift people up. 
and you're not supposed to be around those people that are of dark vibes and dark um, negative connotations that aren't really doing anything in your life you're supposed to move forward and do that and that's what happened to me I completely changed my friend group I completely changed the people that I was dating I decided to go ahead and like go back to being single go going back to being my free spirit and what have you but so so this video is like if you're going through something right now and you're wondering why as a Scorpio rising like why is everything going to shit realize you're gonna go through these moments a lot you're gonna go from nothing to, to everything because of that powerful planet Pluto and with the planet of Mars the best thing about Mars is it's the planet of uh, war aggression uh, Mars is ruled by Aries so it's about it's about pursuing things in the best way and that's why Scorpio risings are so powerful because they have one the Pluto uh, that's like intense and then they have Mars the planet of masculine energy going for the gold asking for that promotion rocking that interview so what you need to do like as a Scorpio rising if things are going bad just change your life change who you're hanging out with set aside like certain savings for like your car or your place or whatever have a game plan and change and um in your mind and then go for it use that mars energy that you have every day what i like to do is i like to write affirmations that like my life is perfect the world is my oyster i'm everyone's favorite person i'm everyone's favorite youtuber hey <laughs> um people enjoy my content people enjoy being around me i attract my soul tribe those are some affirmations you can put down and write that every morning and slowly but surely your life is going to change because where energy um where attention goes energy grows right so you can change your life but do be aware with scorpio rising with that pluto influence it wants to change things as a collective you will go through ups and downs in your life you will go from nothing to something but it will happen really fast you'll get everything back i know a lot of scorpio risings in my life like a lot of scorpio rising friends that have had nothing that have had their card taken away that have got evicted that uh, like just you know their business failed they got fired all that stuff but then they end up making their own business and they make more money they get a better car they get a better place they move to a different state so there is hope for you if you're going through a transformation right now do know that things are going to get better for you and that is my message for you in this video if you would like to see more scorpio rising videos drop down a scorpio uh emoji if you are scorpio rising and you enjoy this video i am also open Open for personal tarot readings, birth chart readings, all the information will be in my description. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the day. Goodbye!